now we're going to look at a diverging lens or a concave lens. This one is considerably weaker than the other lenses we've looked at. Hopefully you can see that the top and the bottom of this lens are a bit thicker than the center. It's not very much thicker, but I don't have another one to use. So this is the one we get. So I've already marked the middle point of the lens and I've got the laser going through the middle point. You can see it pretty much goes straight through. I didn't really show this before, but also if you go through the middle from any other direction, it still goes straight through, all right? But what happens if I go off to the side? So if I come in horizontally off to the side, again, it's much weaker than the others, but you can see this line's coming in pretty much horizontal and this one angles up. If I come down to, remember the other one angled down when you went to the top. If I come down here, now you can see the light's angling out when it comes through. So if I now bring in my five parallel beams, you can see what happens here. We get it lined up this direction. All right, that's pretty well horizontal. So what happens now, the lines come in parallel and then they go out like this. So something like that. All right. There we go. So where's the focal point of this lens? Before, all of the lasers came into one spot and I could easily mark the focal point. This time I can't. What I have to do now is take these lines I've just made and the light didn't really go this other direction. So I'll have to do dotted lines. So if I use dotted lines, since the light didn't really come on this side, dotted lines come back like this. And for the bottom one, it comes up kind of like this. And you can see, if I continued that with all the other ones too, they would also all come here. So the focal point for this lens is actually back here. So a much longer focal length means a much weaker lens. If the, short, if the focal length was short, that would be a strong lens. And just like you know, the other one, we shined the laser in from the other side and it created a focal point there you know, on, on the opposite side. You can see it's doing kind of the same thing here too. The light comes in from this side, expands out. And if I drew lines back, they would come together to another focal point over here. So the lenses, both convex and concave or converging and diverging, either one, either way is a good way to describe them. Uh, both have a midpoint that's important and focal points on each side that are important.